son, I place that oil on him to empower him Jesus. for that which he would do for me. Hallelujah. And God said, I should tell you tonight that let your ways please him. Begin to eat the scriptures. Begin to eat the word. Jesus. And God said, as you begin to eat the word, a time will come in your life, you begin to speak his word. Jesus. And when you begin to speak his word, many will be touched. Jesus. And many will come to know the Lord. Woo. And you didn't come to this ministry by accident. Jesus. You came here for a reason and purpose. Hallelujah. So that God will use us to prepare you for the assignment ahead. Jesus. Because God Himself had spoken to you about it. Am I lying? Huh? Yes. God has spoken to you. And what did God say? Um, I think uh, uh, it was. Um, I had a dream some um, you had a dream uh, years back and um, I saw you and you asked me through questions you, you saw me years back uh, and you, uh, you asked me through questions and you were like do you have a girlfriend and I said no hey do you have a girlfriend <laughs> and uh, you asked me that um, you asked me some other two uh, two uh, questions and immediately you said to me that I was born to be a man of God Jesus. Oh, you have written it down, and you didn't tell me. Did you tell me? I think at that time I you were not here. Clap your hands for Jesus. So, as God has spoken to you, see, when someone is prophesying, it must confirm what you already know. Yeah, man. So, let's stretch our hands towards him.